Welcome to Cybersecurity Awareness Month. My name is Jeremy with the Eaton Rapids Area District Library, and today we're going to talk about strong passwords and how you can strengthen the passwords you've already got. There are really three steps involved, and I'll link to this document that I'm looking at in the description. And you really want to follow all of these steps. First, make them long. In this day and age, the recommendation is 16 characters or longer. Longer is stronger. If you can come up with some sort of a way to make your passwords as long as possible, you'll be thankful you did later. Number two is make them random. And you want to use a string of mixed case characters, numbers, and symbols. An alternative to this is to come up with a memorable phrase of five to seven unrelated words. This would be called a passphrase. Again, longer is better. And if you can get creative with the spelling of those words and substitute numbers or symbols for the letters, you'll be better off in the long run. And finally, make them unique. You should have a different password for every account you've got. And doing a variation of the same password is not enough. Because if one password gets breached, the first thing an attacker is going to do is try variations of that same password. So then, how can you do this and keep all the passwords straight and not be up the proverbial creek if you were to lose a password? Well, that's where a piece of software called a password manager comes into play. There are many on the market, and you can stop by the library and use consumer reports to get a recommendation on what the best one is, depending on your needs. But in essence, a password manager will allow you to save all of your passwords. It will even generate random passwords for you and you only have to remember one master password to access all of your other passwords. And depending on how strongly you feel about managing your passwords and how technology inclined you are, there are even options out there that you can run on your own computer system in a fashion that you could access it anywhere and not have to rely on a third party to store your passwords. And while that concept is a little too advanced for this video, just know that there are options out there to suit basically every need. If we were to do just a simple Google search and select something like PC Magazine's best password managers for 2023, you will get a list of several that they have tested and they are comfortable recommending. And again, you may want to do some of your own research and perhaps you will want to consult Consumer Reports, but know that there are recommendations out there. Stay tuned for other videos in this series as we travel through the remainder of Cybersecurity Awareness Month. I'll see you in the library. Have a great day.